it, of course. Hey Star Wars fans and action figure collectors, welcome back to another video. I uh, haven't had many videos this week, so it's, I'm glad to put one up today. It is the brand new Gaming Greats Flame Trooper, Imperial Flame Trooper from Jedi Fallen Order. This thing looks awesome. Uh, somehow, this wasn't slated until an August or September release, but somehow Zing Pop Culture here in Australia have uh, managed to snag them early, and I believe they are sort of shipping out uh, to GameStops in the US at the moment too, and probably EB Games in Canada as well. So hopefully they show up for you folks very, very soon. But uh, yeah, very fortunate to pick this one up so early. Um, and yeah, it looks great. I, like the, I really like the design of the Flame Troopers. <clears throat> so they look nice. A little bit different to the uh, Incinerator Trooper that we saw in The Mandalorian. Um, they've got different purposes, but uh, this figure looks cool. So uh, let's open it up and take a look. All right, here is the Flame Trooper out of the packaging. And it's looking pretty good. Um, I'm really digging the lot look of it. Um, I thought he was going to be using a lot of the Snow Trooper parts, but um, so, because, you know, design-wise they're very similar to the Snow Trooper. Um, but it's only the torso, the upper, upper arms, the uh, sort of soft plastic karma here, and the upper legs and knees. Uh, the boots, um, I haven't worked out. I believe they're unique new tool for this figure. And uh, the uh, forearms here are new to this figure. So still got the sort of armor underneath, but they've got these sort of... Uh, flame retardant um, sort of cuffs obviously to stop themselves from getting absolutely torched <laughs> um, but yeah the boots the upper arm the forearms here um, the head and the, the backpack there are new pieces so to be unpegged top back in actually not sure if the back the back looks like it could be new as well, but I, I can't remember. It's been a long time since I've actually looked at the uh, snow troopers, but uh, this one's this one looks cool. So he comes with this flamethrower, which is a nice design, sort of red red glow at the end there. Um, I wish they kind of did what they did with the uh, incinerator trooper and gave it a flame effect. That would have been really really cool, but um. So the hose that comes on the back here attaches in through through there. And, uh, should have put that in his hand first, and I will do that. So tuck that in there. That looks cool. ready for action. Obviously pose him up. Get that other arm up underneath. With a little bit of playing. There we go. Oh whatever. You get the point. It can be done. I promise. I just almost just had it so a little bit tricky behind the behind the camera here but um we'll take a look at the helmet sculpt because that's uh probably the most unique thing about this figure it's another really great imperial design imperial faction it's almost got a bit of a sort of with that sort of the quote unquote duck bill it's almost got a little bit of first order about it but yeah it looks cool it's really nice and the the backpack there I mean, look at the sort of gas cylinder like gas cylinders I suppose some nice detailing and paint the snow trooper did have some more sort of paint elements to the torso here throughout the uh little square in there and all so these two little bits um, whereas this guy doesn't have those applied but 
that's okay. So we'll see what got it. A good range of movement on that head too. Um, you'd think that would sort of hinder a fair bit, but uh, actually moves quite nicely from side to side. Not really a lot of up and down movement, but that looks cool. I like it. So I'm digging this figure. This is a nice, nice addition. I'm probably going to try and get a second one. Um, I like to try and get two of each troop. Doesn't always work out for me, but uh, you know what? I'm probably going to stick with one. So yeah, let me know what you think of the Flame Trooper down in the comments below. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please consider doing so. I try to keep up to date with most of the uh, Hasbro stuff that comes out, as well as occasionally a book review and bits and pieces. I also offer memberships to my channel for, you know, next to a cup of coffee per month. So it's, uh, it's not very much to join up. And uh, trying to make an effort to give a little bit of exclusive content to my members as well. Including unboxing videos and just sort of some behind the scenes stuff. But yeah, this is a nice figure guys. Definitely recommend picking this one up. Especially if you're a fan of the Jedi Fallen Order game. And building your Imperial ranks. Because we all know they're awesome. So thank you very much for watching. Till my next video. May the Force be with you. Always.